final game of the season for the number seven Drury Lady Panthers as they visit the minors of Missouri S&T at the Gale Bowman Multipurpose Building. Drury needing a win tonight to secure the number one seed in the GLVC tournament. Miners grab a quick early lead, but that lead quickly evaporated. This is Miners head coach Alan Eads. He was a flurry of emotions in the first half. Seneca Shields running the floor like a guard. That's to the easy way. And that brings Coach Eads off the bench yelling at his team. Name that emotion. What is he feeling? He is angry. We'll check back on him in a minute. Bethany Funderburg coming off a forgettable performance last game. She put her fingerprints all over the first half, and Alan Eads is not happy. Name that emotion. That is the face of frustration. Drury only has nine players, but their best trait might actually be their depth. Hannah Dressler coming off a 15-point game off the bench and immediately contributing. More Bethany Funderburg. She was cooking in the first half, filling it up. 7 of 9 for 17 points. She also led Drury in rebounding in the half of 5. And at this point, Alan Eads is all out of energy. He is catatonic. Yikes. There's Shields again, career high for her, 18 points. Drury with a first half whooping up, 33-51-18. Wouldn't be a Lady Panther highlight without big Amber Dvorak in the mix. Quiet in the first half, she got it going in the second. She rallied off six straight points in about 30 seconds midway through the half. Funderburk with the fine on the last one. Dvorak finished with 22-5, and, and then Funderburk one more time. That makes Mama proud. The Miners did not have an answer for her. 23 for Funderburk to go, six rebounds, four assists. Drury wins their eighth in a row and are the number one seed in the GLVC tournament. I think it's the same mindset we've had all year. I don't feel like anything's changed. Like, I think we've been ready Like ever since the season started. It's like we know the goal, we know what we can do, and we've proven ourselves like to what we think we can accomplish. And so I think our mindset's still the same to just keep going and day by day, game by game. The mindset of that team is for the next two days, I want them to enjoy this. They're champions. Uh, for me, I got to go back to work. If, if I can find out who the seventh seed is, I, I promise you, I'll be watching seventh seed tape on the way home. We'll be ready. Uh, nobody does a better job of preparing a team than us, and, and those kids will go in there knowing that team better than they, the team knows themselves. 